Well, g'day and welcome back to Muty Magic here with another video opening up one of these Magic the Gathering gift packs. Now, it's on sale. Uh, I'm assuming it's because Armand Ket and Hour of Devastation rotate. In case you don't know what's in here, there are five foil lands. There's a foil carry zev, a foil metalwork colossus, and then three booster packs and a spin down. Um, so Arm and Ket and Arab Devastation uh, rotate out very soon. So this was on special. It was 50% off. So $15 uh, Australian, uh, which is pretty decent because you'd normally pay $6 for a booster anyway. So um, this is cheaper for the boosters. Plus you get the foil lands, which is all I care about because the uh, these two cards aren't worth very much because of the selling of this gift pack. Um, but I'm going to crack straight into it. And uh, let's see what we can find in this. Now it's going to be a bit hard with the camera angle to actually show every aspect of what I'm doing here. Um, but yeah, hopefully you guys can see that I'm being legit. I'm not going to, you know, fake anything. I'm not going to pull out a random pack that I prepared earlier. Uh, just in case there is an invocation and someone calls me out like that. Okay, so we're pulling this open. And oh, the other thing that you get in this is this really cool artwork. Um, it is... Pretty sweet, the Gate Watch versus Nicol Bolas. I'm not, uh, yeah, I think that's actually a pretty cool um, artwork. So you get that, and then you get all the other things. So we have a green spin down, obviously. You could see that in the front. We have an Ixalan booster, Arab Devastation, and Armand Ket. Okay, so we'll be opening those in just a moment. Um, but also you get your foil lands, so we'll have a look at each of them. That's the foil island. The Foil Mountain, which I really like this Foil Mountain. Looks pretty sweet. Um, we have the Foil Swamp. The Foil Plains. And we have the Foil Forest. Now these are the Shooting Star lands, in case you don't know what they are. Each of them has a little Shooting Star in it. So there's one right in the background of that. You can see it when the Foil's there. Uh, there's a Shooting Star up in the corner of this one. There's one there. There's one up in there, and there's one over there. So yeah, the, the, the shooting one, the shooting star ones from uh, Mark Poole. So yeah, pretty sweet. They're actually really decent lands. I don't mind them. Um, so yeah, happy to get those. And then we'll get a carry Zev and a Metalwork Colossus, which are really frustrating to get out of this pack. So I might not even bother doing it on screen because I'm going to be using my nails and everyone's going to complain. Uh, so you get those as well. All right, but we're just going to open up these boosters right here. I'm going to start with the oldest and move to the newest, so starting with Armand Ket. Uh, we're going to pull ourselves something decent. Now while I do this, I want to remind you guys that we do have a, a uh, giveaway happening at the moment. It is our Draft Masters giveaway with Core Set 2019. Basically, I open up a booster, you tell me what the best three cards in that booster are if you are playing draft. So go check it out and uh, enter. You may as well, you, you might win. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, we do have a foil. Can we get ourselves an invocation? We have Gate to the Afterlife. Sixth Sense. Destined to lead and our rare is Dispossess. And our foil is an uncommon. Is it a braid? Deemworthy. Okay, foil deemworthy. So that's our first pack. And then we have Hour of Devastation. So really there's not a whole lot in Hour of Devastation that you're after, other than uh, potentially the Scarab God, which does rotate soon, but it does see play elsewhere. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No foil. No invocation in this one, sorry guys. Angel of the God Pharaoh. Supreme Will. Not a bad card. Devotee of Strength. And our rare is... It's just a rare. Juru with eyes open. All right, so that's our second rare. Finally, we have Ixalan. Now, Ixalan does have some value in it, and I have noticed Search for Azkanta has gone up substantially. If you guys have any Search for Azkantas, that's worth a lot now. If you haven't, uh, maybe pick them up. I don't know, because they are, they're gonna hold their value. They're being, they're seeing play everywhere. Uh, it's not just in Standard, they're seeing play in Modern. I think they're seeing play in Legacy, I'm not actually sure. Or Vintage, whatever it is. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. No foil. We have Slice in Twain, Duskborn Sky Marcher, Adanto Vanguard, and we have got, just a rare, Vance's Blasting Cannon, which flips into Spitfire Bastion. So that's the opening. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed that and uh, 
yeah, saw what the gift pack actually holds, and I'm sure you can see it from the outside of the package anyway. Um, but yeah, remember, we do have that giveaway happening. Check it out, go and enter, you may as well. I will be doing the winner uh, announcement probably within the next 24 hours, most likely. It might be a little bit longer, but you don't have long, so jump in there and enter. Otherwise, thank you very much for watching, and uh, yeah, remember to look out for each other. It's the community that makes the game. Make sure you look after one another, and uh, hopefully I'll see you in another video.